summit which allowed the world's 20 leading economies to issue a joint statement on major global issues. The document calls for global pact against hunger, increased aid to Gaza, and an end to war in Ukraine. It also mentions proposal for a future global tax on billionaires and reform of the UN Security Council. However, the text was criticized for a lack of concrete measures as it did not receive anonymous support with Argentina expressing reservations on certain points. As he symbolically handed over the gavel to President Ramaphosa, Lula da Silva underlined the historic nature of the handover as a concrete expression of his historical, economic, social and cultural ties that unite Latin America and Africa. For South Africa, this presidency is a unique opportunity to highlight the priorities of the continent on the international stage. Pretoria intends to focus on tackling inequality, developing infrastructure, and reforming global institutions in line with the African Union's Agenda 2063. South Africa also plans to address multiple crises, such as climate change, food security and energy, which disproportionately affect developing countries. The recent admission of the African Union as a permanent member reflects the growing recognition of Africa's role in global affairs and this chairmanship marks a crucial milestone for the G20.